But you know, a coat of paint does an amazing thing. It really makes things look a whole lot better. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to make it look a whole lot better. still see that. That thing was collapsed right down. The reason the guy sold it to me was he couldn't figure out why it kept flooding over. Uh, gas just ran through it. He had no idea so I got it for a cheap price. New float runs great. So that hangs up up here on the wall just because I never saw that before. I bet you're all sitting there wishing, hoping that I'm going to dump this thing, right? Yeah, I know. I could tell. I could tell. I wasn't born yesterday, you know. You're hoping that you're going to get to see me dump the whole mess. Well, I'm going to do my best not to let it happen. Cut the edges with a brush. Do the main part with the roller. You get this wall done. Be dry enough tomorrow, I can hang up my Sitco sign and some other signs I get. Oh yeah, I'm going to be just like our people, you know, with signs up inside my garage here. One thing I don't have is I don't have a, a street, street light, but that's okay. I can be like him in a lot of other ways. Okay, I got it done all the way over to the door here. Uh, by the way, that door is a door to nowhere. If I took it around the outside, you'd see that they sided right over it. Uh, one problem I have to address, though, is uh, it leaks underneath that door. They never sealed it, evidently. So um, one of these days when I have a whole day to spend out there, I've got to pull the siding back and take that door out and caulk around the bottom and then put the door back on, or maybe I'll just frame it in and uh, sheetrock that hole, use the door somewhere else maybe. Good steel door still. But there you have it. And uh, first step, get my Until garage. next time, this is George, the Shade Tree Fix-It Man, saying thanks for watching.